Hello, I'm gonna give Barbara a call. Uh, I got I got a new pet that I want to show us. I hope she picks up. Let me let me give her a call. Ooh, oh, it's hi. ringing. Hello. Hi, Barbara. How are you? I'm good. How are you doing? Oh, I'm good. I uh, I wanted to tell you that I got a new a new little uh, thing in my home. Oh, what what would that be? Well, I actually got four of them. I got some little baby chicks. Do you want to see them? You got a bag of chips. What was that? Oh no, I got some baby chicks. <gasps> some baby chicks, like some chickens. That's right. Oh my goodness, can I see them, please? Oh, of course. Tell me when you can see them. I don't know if I can get them. Oh, yeah. I, oh, there they are. Oh, how cute. How many do you have there? Three or four? Four, okay, I love them so. That's so cute. They're just pecking away. They sure are, and you know what? If I, if I wait long enough, they're gonna lay some eggs for me. <gasps> well, isn't that special? Now you can have some eggs every day. That's right. A little fun, fresh eggs straight from my very own farm. How oh, cool. Oh, I just love it. Well, how have you been doing besides the chicks? Good. How are you? I'm doing How good. are you doing? Doing great. I was reading through some recipes here, thinking about uh, maybe baking a little uh, bread later tonight. Oh, that sounds delightful. Yeah. Have you read any good books recently? You know, I'm always reading books. Uh, I, I haven't read a whole lot in the past couple days. Um, so do you got anything with you? Oh, I do. I have, a, I have this book. It's called Good People Everywhere. Would you like Ooh. to read that with me? Good People Everywhere. Now that sounds nice. It, it sure is. It's by, uh, well, let's see. It's illustrated by Christina Swana. Mm -hmm. And it's written by Linnea Gillen. Yeah. Sorry, I got to keep an eye on my chicks. They, they look like they're fine. All right. Uh, so I'll go ahead and read the first page and then you can read the next page. Okay, go ahead. Today in neighborhoods all over the world, millions and millions of people are doing very good things. Yeah, tell me. Today, carpenters are building fences and houses and repairing homes that have been damaged by storms. Today, moms and dads are cooking dinner for their families and cooks are working in kitchens making meals for people who don't have homes. Oh, that's very nice, very nice. Doctors and midwives are delivering babies and gently passing them into the eager arms of their parents. Oh, how sweet. Teachers, oh, I know we have a lot of good teachers at Shamrock Cottage. We do. They're teaching math, spelling, and reading skills. And musicians are opening their hearts and playing beautiful music. Oh, oh, I love the harp. One of my favorites. Beautiful. Ooh, and dancers are leaping across dance floors, practicing performances that will bring joy to their friends, their families, and their communities. Today, people are planting seeds, picking fruits and vegetables. Ooh. And driving them to grocery stores all around the world so you can have a ripe, juicy orange in your lunch. Today, a child is trying her very best to do well on her science test, and a teenage boy is helping a young child who is sad and lonely. Oh. Oh, that's very nice. That is very nice. Today, a first grade boy is helping a friend who has a skinned knee. Oh, would you look at that? Scoot over the picture a little bit there, Dolores. Oh, how nice, yes. 
and a big sister is holding her baby brother while her mother runs across the street to help a neighbor. Oh. Will you go up a little bit? The words are too low. There we go. A little more. <laughs> up a little more. Today, millions and millions of people will do very good things. And so will you. I wonder what you will do. Oh, nice. I saw a little you picture know, there. Gonna... Yes. And I saw a little picture there in the back of maybe like the authors or something. A couple more pages. Oh, there. well, there was a little there was a little picture. It says, who are the good people in your community? And you could close your eyes and think of all the good people in your life, and you can create a good person award to give to someone. Who you oh. want to thank for doing something good for you. That's so kind. Well, I think you I should mean, have a good person award, Dolores. Oh, well, thank you. I, I just love how all the all these this book outlines is how many wonderful things that we can do for each other and mm -hmm. our community, and how it doesn't matter how young you are or how old you are, you can always do something to help. That's true. That's true. Well, um, hey, before we go today, I gotta ask, where did you get that long extended phone cord? Where did oh, you get well, that? You, know, you can reach outside. I, yes, the, well, you know, I've, I've always, I've heard about, I've heard about these cordless phones. This one's just stretched really far into my home. I mean, mine doesn't go that far. I gotta get one longer like that so I can get outside. Yeah, well, maybe for your story. birthday, I'll order you one. Okay, yeah, they're, they're very nice. Yeah, it, it's almost like having one of these newfangled cellular telephones that people talk about, but I'm yeah. not quite ready for that. Oh yeah, me neither. My goodness, we've made it this far. Why oh, well, change I now? See there's a, there's a, oh, that's right. That's right. Well, I see a, a couple bees buzzing around. It makes me want to go inside. I think they hit all the flowers, but they're, they're okay. kind of scary. Yeah. There's also a cat who looks like he's uh, really too excited about these chicks. So oh. uh, I best well, be take going. Care of your great chicks. talking to you. Great talking Thank to you, you. Dolores. Bye-bye. And good luck with your bread. Bye-bye. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Bye.